What's up everybody? Welcome back to the action sofa. I am still all by myself because Duncan was abducted by aliens and shot full of drugs and is probably being anally probed right now. I'm right here. <laughs> oh, hey. Have you been there the whole time? <laughs> yeah. It's been weird. <laughs> I didn't really know what to say. <laughs> so Duncan is back uh, and I'm happy to have him back. And we are playing The Little Mermaid to celebrate his return. Yay! <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. You better damn well be happy. <laughs> I'm so happy! Listen to how happy I am. <laughs> I <don't laughs> Is that a happy noise? I don't... <laughs> That's... I don't... I don't know what being audibly happy sounds like. I mm. just... I try... I did my best. Well, this is what me being audibly happy sounds like. I'm just happy to have you back, buddy. Is that better? Yeah. I'm excited. They're telling us the story of what is happening in the game, um, of which I am almost completely ignoring. Uh, well, I mean, we've, we've It's basically seen the story of The Little Mermaid, as far as I can tell, except she's already in love with... The prince and everything's cool, so this might be after. So this is after the movie. Uh, Ariel's in her human form. She plans to wed Prince Eric, and uh, upon learning that the sea witch Ursula plans to take control of the ocean, Ariel leaves Eric to become a mermaid once more and sets off to rescue her underwater friends. Hmm. That's very sad. That's like kind of a bittersweet uh, start to this game. Yeah, that's uh, that's. Creepy. So I have uh, I have control over Ariel with her bright pink hair, and they start me with less than full health. Which thanks for that, guys. They're just showing you that uh, you have room to improve. What's that thing? I don't know, but I'm juggling it. <laughs> I don't seem to have any other abilities. <laughs> really? You can just oh okay. Oh hey, look you you picked up a thing. I don't okay. Ooh, treasure chest. Aha! Yeah, you got a... ball? Yep. Can I... okay. Do I touch that to make them... okay? <laughs> Wait, oh. So you... You bubbleize him, and then you grab him, and then you can you kick throw him. him. Can I dig? I seem to... yeah, there we go. Oh, hey! I seem to recall a... something along those lines. Huh. I don't remember a lot about this game, and I think my older brother Ryan mostly played it. Um, so I'm going to do my best. Or the action sofa equivalent. <laughs> right, these were items that you could use to, like... Throw? Yeah, and they, they just didn't go away, so like you could take it with you. Whereas right. the enemies will go... Right. Once you kill them. Yeah, take that stupid octopus thing. Oh, ooh, do I need it to? Yeah. Ah! Whoa. Okay. Low memory rate. <laughs> Never mind. I didn't want that treasure chest anyway. This guy's gonna chase after me, I think. Or he's just gonna swim off in a random direction. Secrets. No secrets. No. Felt like a secret. Ooh, does that make me go faster? Am I faster when I do that? Nah, eh, maybe. I don't know. Feels like I move. Oh. No. <laughs> Feels like I move faster when I hold down that button, so I'm just gonna assume that I do. Uh, do I need something? Just anything to crack that open? No, I. I you need, need a. The, you need a shell or whatever. Need the it is. shell. There you go. Okay. All right. Well, lesson learned. Boom! Now you get a green thing. Sweet. Which doesn't have any discernible purpose. <laughs> or use. And can I just take this guy with me as long as I... Oh, just gonna ditch that. Oh, a shark. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, is, this, uh, is this the first boss, perhaps? Ah, so you just have to... What? Okay. Oh, you can you shoot them up. Them that's up. good, that's that's good to know. Yeah. Oh, screw you, shark. <laughs> Um, this feels very, uh, Chippendale Rescue Rangery to me. How about you? 
Uh, yeah. Very similar. I mean, I'm I'm almost <laughs> certain that it would be the same uh, team. Similar, same team, right? Well, I mean, it is, this is Capcom, right? This is a Capcom game. It's made around the same time. It's a Disney game. Yeah. <laughs> or a Disney brand, anyway. So let's have a look here. Pr producers. Tokuro Fujiwara. Uh... Yeah, so he created Ghosts and Goblins, produced the Mega Man series. That um, man is a saint. <laughs> and, uh... Yeah, he's worked on a bunch of games, and... Yeah, so... Yeah, he was the producer on Chippendale Rescue Rangers as well. There we go. That that um, makes sense. <laughs> and he was an executive producer on Little Nemo the Dream Master. Hooray! Which we which was I think the first game that we uh, that we let's let's play it on this channel. It was. Also one of my favorites. Yeah. Oh, ghost. Okay. Ah! <laughs> F -f -f fish goes. <laughs> oh man, man, this guy has a this guy has a lot of uh, has a lot of credits. He has been in the game industry for a long, long time. I okay. Nice. <laughs> He's sometimes credited as Professor F or Arthur King. <laughs> We will look for that in the credits, then. Boom. And that's how you open that chest, for some reason. He is notorious for making his titles difficult for the average video game player. Oh, oh I have a triple bubble now. Nice. For some reason. I don't know what that means. Me neither. Oh, hey, look, a little mini aerial. Yay! I'm gonna kick this one down the stairs so that I can... Get that other chest. Ah! Oh! My head! It's been caved in by this rock. Oh, okay, I don't have... I don't have a, uh, a bubble right now. Oh, weird. So you have, like, a different ability? I guess. Is that what those is that what those red things are? Perhaps. Or because the... yeah, now I have to hit them multiple times. Ah. To get the same effect. Right, so you have a less good version of whatever it is that you had before. I guess, yeah. Well huh. there you go. Weird. Well, we'll get a better version here. Oh god, I can't knock it over. Uh mm. maybe you use the fish to knock it over? Perhaps. You can do it! I believe in you! What? <laughs> well, thankfully this game has a low memory, and so I can just keep doing it. <laughs> My belief was misplaced! Shut up, Duncan. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Uh, no, that just didn't work. Just, alright. <sighs> okay, well, here we go. I guess we'll just keep on trucking. Yeah! Hit him with fish. Well, it means I can't get that one up either. Or have fun at the under the sea ball. Hey, I can jump out of the water. Look at you go. Do you remember, uh... Do you remember when you remember first seeing uh, what was it called, uh, Little Mermaid? Yeah, because it was uh, much later than it should have been. <laughs> I was oh, like, I was like fifteen or fourteen when I saw it. Oh, really? You didn't see it like you know? I was not. Yeah, no. I it completely bypassed me, and everyone was always talking about it. So I was like, okay, it was on TV. I might as well watch this Little Mermaid thing. And it's it's fun. It's a fun movie. It's a good film. Oh Mark. God, no! <laughs> it may have it may have been the first Disney film that I saw, and cer certainly the first one I saw in theaters. I was probably about four years old, maybe five. Wow. And uh, yeah, it was a good movie. Great music and all sorts of fun characters and lots of stuff that talks that shouldn't be able to talk. 
<laughs> I have the distinct feeling I'm supposed to push that rock, so let's get in there and try and do that. Nope. All right. They're See, not, you, octopus. You're they're not gonna let you push that rock. Yep. Almost positive I'd need it for that thing. Weird. Yeah. Well, maybe I can get lucky and there's a shell hidden in here somewhere. Nope. Come on. No. Nope. Nope. Doesn't look like it. Aha! <laughs> Video game senses. Kicking in! <laughs> yes, you do have good, uh, you do have good video game senses. I am, uh, I am still often, often quite, uh, quite amazed when all of a sudden you like, Oh, this, this is a false wall. <laughs> <laughs> or of course you need to go over here. It's not always that obvious. Nope. Oh, and disappearing shell. Oh no, it's, um... The eels. The eels, uh, and their names are Flotsam and Jetsam. Yeah, that makes sense. There we go. I did not remember, so I'm glad you did. Yeah. I remember those names not making a whole lot of sense when I was very young, because I did not have the vocabulary for that, but I'm sure my parents appreciated it. That was one of the earlier, uh adult jokes <laughs> kids would miss out on I don't even know that it's like an adult joke it's no just it's like... just something that is it's a little bit more clever <laughs> yeah it's just it's 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 too it's too smart or too you just just slightly too clever for uh, for just little kids to to kind of understand you're gonna have some trouble with this by the looks of it I am yes could you... For for reals, though? Come on. There we go. Nice. Gotta get him when he's walking. Yeah. Yay, stupid... Stupid eels. Uh, where are you gonna be? Oh, jeez, okay. That's, uh... <laughs> I don't know if you could tell from my audible surprise, but that caught me off guard. Whoa! <laughs> Haha! <laughs> That's one jerk down. One jerk to go. You're next, Duncan. <laughs> yeah, 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 you keep saying that and I'm still here. <laughs> Except for that, except for those times when I wasn't. <laughs> That's, yeah, fair enough. But I came back! Stronger than ever! Not really. <laughs> it's about, about the same. About as strong as I was the last time I saw you. Funny. Smell says otherwise. <laughs> you did it! I did it! And I only died twice? <laughs> I have no idea how the continue system in this game works. But we might find out next time on the action software.